हेलो स्टूडेंट्स टुडे वी लर्न व्हाट इज कोवेरियंस सो डेफिनेशन ऑफ कोवेरियंस इफ कैपिटल एक्स एंड कैपिटल वाई बी एनी टू रैंडम वेरिएबल्स रैंडम वेरिएबल्स देन कोवेरियंस बिटवीन देम इज डिफाइंड बाय कोवेरियंस ऑफ एक्स वाई नोटेशन कोवेरियंस ऑफ एक्स वाई मीन कोवेरियंस बिटवीन एक्स एंड वाई इज इक्वल टू एक्सपेक्टेशन ऑफ एक्स माइनस ई ऑफ एक्स इन टू वाई माइनस ई ऑफ वाई सो दिस इज डेफिनेशन ऑफ कोवेरियंस बिटवीन एक्स एंड वाई इज इक्वल टू एक्सपेक्टेशन ऑफ एक्स माइनस ई ऑफ एक्स वाई माइनस ई ऑफ वाई And you know the definition of expectation of random variable x if x is discrete random variable or if x is continuous a random variable. Now this can be written as e is equal to expectation of by our usual product. <coughs> you carry out the product x y minus x into e of y. then minus y into e of x then minus minus become plus e of x into e of y so again this can be written as expectation of x y minus e of x into e of y then you know the properties of expectation minus e of y into e of x then expectation of expectation x means itself uh plus e of x into e of y so here minus expectation of x into e of y plus e of x into e of y these terms cancel so what is remaining e is equal to expectation of x y minus e of x into e of y so this is the covariance of x y suppose this is number 1 if x and y are independent random variables independent random variables then expectation of x y is equal to e of x into e of y so you know that definition or uh, you know the theorem or property that is if x and y are independent random variables then expectation of x y is equal to e of x into e of y so using 2 in 1 what we get we see using 2 in 1 we get what we get so one is covariance of x y is equal to so e of x y means e of x into e of y if x and y are independent random variables e of x into e of y minus e of x into e of y so e of x Into your point minus e of x into your point is 
जीरो और इफ यू टेक ई ऑफ एक्स कॉमन इन ब्रैकेट ई ऑफ वाई माइनस ई ऑफ वाई देन ई ऑफ वाई माइनस ई ऑफ वाई जीरो ई ऑफ एक्स इंटू जीरो इज इक्वल टू जीरो देर फॉर को वेरियंस ऑफ एक्स वाई इज इक्वल टू जीरो वेन कैपिटल एक्स एंड कैपिटल वाई आर इंडिपेंडेंट रैंडम वेरियंस so you will remember this result if x and y are independent then covariance between them is zero now property property of covariance property first if capital x and capital y are any random variables आर एनी रैंडम वेरिएबल्स एंड स्मॉल ए एंड स्मॉल बी आर एनी कॉन्स्टेंट देन देन यू आर टू प्रूव दैट को वेरियंस ऑफ ए एक्स बी वाई is equal to covariance of x y is equal to a b into covariance of x y is equal to a into b covariance of x y so solution are proof of this so what is the definition of covariance if x and y are any two random variables then the covariance between them is defined by covariance of x y is equal to expectation of x minus e of x into y minus e of y this is the definition of covariance and you have to prove कोवेरियंस ऑफ ए एक्स बी वाई इजल टू ए बी इन टू कोवेरियंस ऑफ एक्स वाई सो हियर को वेरियंस ऑफ ए एक्स बी वाई इज इक्वल टू एक्सपेक्टेशन ऑफ बाई डेफिनेशन ओनली ए एक्स माइनस एक्सपेक्टेशन ऑफ ए एक्स into by minus expectation of by so this can be written as expectation of ax minus a into expectation of x into by minus b into expectation of y now here you take a common again this can be written as expectation of a into x minus e of x and here b common into y minus expectation of y so here a into b then my properties of expectation this can be written as a into b into expectation of x minus e of x into y minus e of y but what is this expectation of x minus e of x into y minus e of y this is the definition of covariance so e is equal to a into b into covariance of x y using definition of covariance are using one therefore covariance of a x b y e is equal to 
ए बी इंटू ओ वेरियंस ऑफ एक्स वाई सो सिमिलरली यू कैन प्रूव रिमेनिंग प्रॉपर्टीज होमवर्क Prove that. If x and y are any random variables, and a, b are constants. Then, number one, same using same definition, you prove that covariance of x plus a comma y plus b is equal to covariance of x y. Same definition, so you obtain the result covariance of x plus a y plus b is equal to covariance of x y. And number two, covariance of a x plus b comma c y plus d is equal to again by definition of covariance you obtain the result is equal to a into c of covariance of x y so using definition of covariance you prove these two results so next lecture we see that what is variance and properties and examples of variance so we stop here thank you